this is the Bat Girl Jamie Show. Take a peek. Whoop whoop and welcome to the Bat Girl Jamie Show. I'm Bat Girl Jamie and I was here to t do a movie review that I promised a f someone, a fan that I would do because he gave me the idea. He wanted me to do a review of it because I told him I was watching the movie because we talk. I talk to this fan all the time. His name, his name is God, Lonnie. And he's a really great person. I'm really thirsty tonight. But thank you, Twisted J, for the Fago Cherry Cola. Okay. The movie review I'm doing is a Daniel Radcliffe movie I watched a couple nights ago when I was bored. Like, I think I watched it like Thursday night because I had Friday off and I sit up a little bit later and I watched this movie. And it's called Horns and it's really good. Like, I legit cried towards the end of the movie when you find out really what happened to the person. Oh, and when you see his reaction, when he finds out what really happened to his girlfriend. Okay. It's all about a guy, a guy who, um, his girlfriend died, and they're suspecting he did it, which he didn't do it at all. Like, flat out in the beginning, it's decla he declares that he did not do it. That, and it shows, um, basically the, how their relationship was, and it was so loving. They loved each other so, 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 so much, and... They wanted to spend forever together. And then one night, and then she comes up dead. And it goes back into their child and how they met and da da da. But she, so she comes up dead and they're suspecting he did it. And he's doing all these crazy things to try to prove, try to figure out who did it because he wants to know who did it because he didn't do it. Then um, it shows how they broke up the night before he it took him a while his dad never gave her the key gave gave him the key that he was supposed to give him that told why she broke up with him when she when he finds out why she broke up with him he was really sad like sad sad but i guess when she died it stopped it was it's just a whole complicated story like he grows horns and he go everyone he goes around that sees those horns are really bad people and they have bad things thoughts in their head and stuff and they do but they're gonna do bad it makes them do bad things and it makes them admit things to him like his parents like kick him out of the ho out of their house when he goes to visit them and tells him that he they don't want anything to do with him that he was a disappointment and bad and all this yeah no crap but it's just a great Daniel Radcliffe movie like great it shows him in a different light and it's a great film if you've got Netflix go watch Horns excuse me sorry Horns with Daniel Radcliffe definitely definitely loved that movie I would definitely and probably will go watch it again because I love it that much. I give it two thumbs up and a big old flat round of applause. Best movie I've seen in a long time that's under the radar. And I have to admit, I do like Daniel Radcliffe. So, I say yes to that movie. Definitely yes. So, if you've got any movies that you think I would like, comment below with what movie you think I would like. If you have Netflix or Hulu and um or a TV show that you think I would like and tell me if you like it. Tell me the name of it and I'll go check it out. And if I like it, I'll review it for you guys. I don't always like the movies I review because I give you my honest opinions. And I liked this movie. Honest to goodness loved that movie. Like, definitely, definitely recommend anybody who likes Daniel Radcliffe to go see this, um, movie horns. And then, then be look on, on the lookout for my unboxing of my unique makeup that I ordered from my mom's party. 
And be on the lookout for the blind bag that I bought my niece. I'm going to show you which ones I bought her and which ones she'll be opening on their channel, the kids' channel. And that's the Let's R Us Kids. And her show is the Miss Gracie P show on there. So she does her own show on there. And then do no, Twisted J's um, niece and nephew do a show on there too together. So th there's two different shows on one channel. We just put our nieces and nephews together. And then... Go check them out and subscribe to them. They're the Let's R Us Kids. Just so if you want to search for them, they'll be in, they're in the link below. They're in the link below for our other social medias. They're in there for other YouTubes. And they're on the sidebar too. They're the Let's R Us Kids. And if you just want to search for them, it's Let's R Us Kids. Search that way. Because if you search the Let's R Us Kids, all it'll bring up is the Letters R Us Kids. And you won't be able to find them. But... I just wanted to let you guys know. Go check out Twisted J's channel. And don't forget to check out the Juggalettes R Us. And we'll be having new videos soon. Um, thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe. And have a wonderful weekend. weekend. Peace out. And much fun love to the Juggalo family.